See, umpire throws the ball in the air, neither Mench or Morgan get it down. Leak gets the actual tap down, goes towards Murphy at half forward, can't take it with him, tries to tap it on, threw it. Oh well, the punts came out early, 30 seconds in. Yes, a bit stiff. Let's see, we're going to have a bit of trouble with him already. Back, half back flank. And where we've got the free, they go towards the middle and over the back. Oh, oh that's a good mark. mark, McKenzie, who's been in sparkling form in the last th three or four weeks. Good player. And, uh, Played very nicely last week on Luke Forbes. He goes to centre-half forward. Long lead. Hermans comes out. In the middle, McFarlane. Werribee get the handball free. Leak gets across there first. He's going to have a couple against him. Walson was one of them. He got uh, in front. He did pretty well. The captain. He goes with the right foot. Slung as he got the kick away. Goes towards half forward. Hermans tries to tap it forward. Gains 25 metres. Goes uh, towards Venables and also McFarlane. Now the ball. Oh, that's it's holding on the, the ball. ball. And there's a nice punts. I like that one. <laughs> he was very close to the ground. And the ball will come back. And Brody Donald's going to have the free kick. 40 out. Slight angle. Well, I'll tell you what, put your glasses down, Eric, from what we saw oh, last week. Jeez, that's an early call. No, no, yeah, no, I know, for this no, goal. I know, but a minute and a half, and he's just had a touch. I said, put your glasses down for this goal, because from what he, we saw right. last week, he was kicking them from 50. He's a beautiful kick for goal, this kid. he probably do his hammy now. There he comes in. Brody Donald. He's missed. Oh, he was always going to miss. <laughs> Soon as you said he something. He was abs Central's yet to score. Two minutes played first term. <laughs> so where have we bring the ball in day. quickly? <laughs> Decide to go to the uh, stand side. Morgan oh, dives. Can't take geez. the footy. Luke mops up. Just gets the foot to ball. Picked up. Back towards the middle four. Where are we? Jones. Good position. Good mark. In front. It's where you have to be. Now they're starting to spread the uh, where are we side. Fantastic feet. Handball come back to Jones. Handball himself. Now uh, tries to follow up. Picked up Bray. Terrible handball. McKenzie stole it. Handball to Leak. Here go Winch now. Going forward very, very wide. Making the, the half forwards lead to it. And uh, it is over the I mean, <coughs> Two and a half minutes. First quarter. Interesting so far. The ball in the forward half for the uh, Winchelsea side. But where we have something to say about that. Trying to bring it back. But... Jeez, he brought the punts out early twice in two minutes. Now the whistle was uh, a free kick to winch an advantage paid. <clears throat> and the ball now in the last line of defence for Werribee. Great mark there. Down for... the field anyway. <coughs> Hermans was late. Right, so. He's going to bring this back. Yeah, what's happened? <coughs> He's not going to allow the advantage. He's going to bring it back for the down the ground free kick. So Monte Bruno with the free kick. Didn't go behind <laughs> the mark anyway. No, he didn't. <laughs> so <laughs> not a great effort there from the umpire. Nick takes the mark, centre wing, brings it back toward the corridor. That's good positioning. Great mark there for Quarrier. Handball, oh, they're away quickly as the ball uh, goes behind Cassidy on that occasion. High tackle. <coughs> That's got to be holding the ball. Oh, he's brought it out again. Third time in three minutes, the big fella. Yeah, but mind no. you, they're right. Yeah, that, no, the first one wasn't. Anyway, go towards Hermans at half forward, takes the mark uncontested. He gets a little and getting back there, Knight. We'll see it through for a rush behind of the Blues. So they double their score. They are two behinds. And Werribee Central's yet to score. That's on the Buckley's Entertainment Centre scoreboard. Four minutes played. Those flags are flying, but it didn't affect that kick. That no. was a good long kick. Nobody in the scoreboard either here at uh, St Albans. The score is still 0-0 zero, zero for both sides. The kick in from Werribee was uh, not great. And the Blues put the pressure on. Close to the boundary line. Knight draws a couple of players and gets it over the top. Bonner kept the pressure on. Can they break? I think they might have actually seen it over the boundary line. They have the central's defence. So we'll have a boundary throw in. 40 around from the winch goal. They're kicking to the northern end of this first term. Boundary throw in for... Well, I think it'll be Morgan. And it looks like Higgins against him. And Higgins gets it down, in fact. Goes towards Murphy, close to the boundary line. They can't keep it in. the boundary. Thompson, though. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>. he does. <clears throat> we discovered that. Ball thrown in at the back, Higgins. Missed umpire... He's given a free kick to Morgan. Ruck infringement, I assume. So Morgan now for Werribee Centrals. Halfback flank. <coughs> kicks it low, skimming Jones. I don't know who his opponent is, but he's on his own. And now goes towards half forward. Out of position, Van der Klooster. That's Does his put opponent. a spoil on. As uh, picked up there by Cornish. <coughs> Back to Jones. Handball out wide. Back to Cornish. Cornish now. Can he go inside forward? 50 does with the long kick. Monte Bruno, two to beat. They do well, Winch in defence, or Cassidy taken high, I would have thought. No, said the umpire. That's the ball now in dispute. Where uh, Winch will see 
In the fence, in a bit of trouble. Matheson will get them out of it. Gets a handball. Season. Oh, oh terrible handball. No prior season. opportunity. Oh! No prior opportunity, umpire. <laughs> he had no chance whatsoever. So free, oh. kick, free kick has gone to Salmond. He's about 60 from goal. Decides to chip the pass. It's not a good pass. Mark not taken. Oh. Well, I think an Academy Award, but he's going to get the free kick. And... Uh, Look, te have, technically it was there, Eric, but yeah. they normally let that go when you exaggerate it like that. But uh, what a Bruno it is. He's 45 metres from goal. I think he's going back to Geelong West to have the kick. Well, I'll tell you <coughs> what, I might sound very biased when I say this, but he's a shocking kick. He's got no hope. <laughs> <laughs> well, I see. <laughs> so, Tyron Montebruno, arguably the best goal kicker in the comp this year, but for injury... Comes around. It's a beautiful Look kick at up that. the boots. Look at that. There's the first goal of the uh, game. It's running at full steam. So Morgan gets it down. Row beautifully. Braden Montebruno through the middle. Right foot kick towards brother Tyrone. Comes out. Takes a mark. And pretty hard to stop that from Byron Matheson for no Winch. Chance. And you know, shoot for two in a minute now. The big fella. He's 35 out directly in front. Southern end of the ground. I just wonder, Grubby, if Van der Kloester's forte is not minding a man but playing that loose man across the back half. Oh, I think the Werribee Central's coach is very, I, very well aware of that. I think he's exploiting it. Yeah, it happened last week. He's trying not to happen again. Montebruno comes in, left foot kick, high, and it's right through the middle for his second. Middle, Mench doing uh, battle this time with Morgan. Neither get the tap down, comes to ground. Winch first on the seam, but a great tackle, Cassidy. Cause a spillage. Now Werribee, can they uh, clean it out of the middle there? Van der Kloester picks it up, handball out wide. Mench tried to kick off the ground for Winch. Not getting too far, however, as uh, numbers around the Ooh. ball seem to uh, certainly favour the Werribee side. Kick off the ground goes to Davis for Winch. You'll see he can't get clear. Morgan put the ground. Gee, it's pretty hard and tough. Venables handball to Leek. Leek tackle high. No, said the umpire. I it was. He goes out wide. Has... Uh, a race for the boundary, and Wilson is in front, but the ball, he runs low to the ground as the ball comes in again. This time, Murphy doing the ruck work, comes to Davis, four winch, round the body towards half forward. Higgins seems to be uh, being held there, but uh, where will be away again towards the boundary line? In fact, uh, no, it must have bounced right on the line. So that's a good clearing kick for Werribee. They've gained 50 metres, but uh, certainly the wind carried that along. I think there's a fair bit of wind there. Almost 10 minutes in the quarter. Werribee Central's two goals. Winchell's here two behinds. So a throw in. Well, they're going to get a bit of injection of height as Nigel Lovell comes onto the ground. <laughs> Boundary <laughs> throw in. Morgan. And Mench in front. Morgan from behind. Wilson to run onto it on centre wing for Winchell. See, tries to tap it back to Bonner. Does so. Gets the right foot kick to half forward. Over the head of Higgins. Coming out, Hermans. Grabs it. Does well. Wheels and goes. Goes to the right foot kick high towards full forward. Donald Gog. Intelligent punch to Venables. If it sits for him, it doesn't. And he's under pressure of the two number ones. Fight for it. Knight does very nicely. Got his hand to it. But uh, Donald gets back there. Gets the left, left foot kick back towards the 10 metres square. Off the back of the pack. And once again, the Centurions have got the numbers and they're going to be able to go and clear to the outer side looking for Blushki who can uh, run onto it. Mench comes at him, handballs it or kicks it around the corner. Terrible in the end. McKenzie stands there, gets around, wheels, gives it to Mench. Handball back in board to Wilson. Off a step, tumbling punt to half forward. Might be okay. Davis should have taken the mark. Probably because he was talking to Grubby. That's why he dropped it. <laughs> and then boundary. Uh, ball up. No, the umpire says play on. Werribee Central still got the numbers around the ball. Blushki on the forward end. Goes with the right foot kick to half forward. Bray Mench chops it off. Does does nicely. Back to Wentz. It came at centre half forward. Opens it up the play. Goes to Venables. Takes the mark at centre half forward. Wants to wheel and go quickly. Hermans gives him a lead. Kick it to him. He goes in that direction now over the back. He can't park, take the mark from there. Push Punches it back towards Davis. Off a standing start. Kicks with the outside of the right boot towards a 10 metre square. Murphy comes out. Takes the mark. And they worked pretty hard there. The Winchell C boys to get it to uh, 10 metres out from goal. And Rob Murphy's taken the mark. And we'll have a set shot for Winchell C's first. So Mench with the uh, the mark at half back was the the turnover they needed. Oh, steal me thunder, will you? <laughs> <laughs> and Murphy, we don't need you then. Okay, Murphy kicks the goal. So his first of the afternoon and the first for Winch may have started at half four, full forward. 
Well, Lovell and uh, Mench went for the uh, ruck contest there. The ball comes clear. No other side getting in a great advantage. So kick off the ground. That time from King for Werribee Centrals. Race for the football uh, in front of our broadcast position. Nice oh, handball to Monte Bruno. Monte Bruno handball back. Goes back to. Uh, couldn't see who that was back there. And no, Lovell finally accepts a handball. Handball forward. See, it's pretty scrambly now as the ball comes out clear for Winchelsea. Now the handball. Well, that's a terrible handball ground. to advantage for uh, Werribee. Oh, uh, that's another terrible handball. That was Jeez. by Tornia and uh, tries to recover the footy. It's gone to season. He's, uh, well, the ball, he was dispossessed, certainly. Picked up there for Werribee. It's a long kick towards goal. It's rolling, rolling, rolling. It is uh, behind. Uh, work to do for the winch defence. Matheson, in the end, taken over the line. And bench. Then the ruck work up against Toby Bray. Mench in front, goes to the side of the pack. Matheson ripped off the football and he loves the punts, the big oh. fella, doesn't he? He loves it. He pulls it out and they play on advantage. And, and the advantage missed. So, 13, Werribee Centrals. Winch 1 2 8. And we played 14 and a half minutes. So, Van der Kloost, uh, took the mark, tips it back into the corridor. Dangerous move, but uh, comes off because Mark taken by Stephen. He goes out wide. Coming up a long, long way from the forward half is Herman's <coughs> in front of our broadcast box, which is just backward of centre. 50. So there's a 50. <clears throat> Not too sure what for. He said he ran through the mark, but I didn't see anyone run through the mark. Well, the umpire was uh, Johnny on the spot, so Herman's has uh, got the benefit of a 50-metre penalty. Now uh, he's up forward of centre. Decides to go across the ground. Gee, that's negative. What he's got that? one player out there, but he's got two to beat. It's McKenzie. Oh. Does well. And in fact, it's uh, Higgins. Handball back to Mench. Oh. So uh, they've made a mess of it. Mench had another chance. Now he's found the mark. Chip went around the corner. Now the long kick to foot. Oh. Oh, brilliant mark up there. <laughs> so it's, uh, well, the umpire's played a free kick against McFarlane there and now advantage. So uh, <laughs> Warwick Kappa hands on the shoulders. <laughs> I think he played a, a hold, throwing the ball. Oh. The turnover's gone there to uh, Holmes and he's found Herman's. Just inside forward 50, but uh, to our thoughts, perhaps slightly against the bruise and maybe the bruise across his shoulder, which would be a very, very difficult kick from there. But we saw earlier, he certainly uh, will have a fair shake at making the distance. Rotation's grubby. Uh, they've been copious amounts at this point in time. They're coming on and off everywhere. I'd agree with you if I knew what that meant. <laughs> Herman, what a magnificent kick oh, for a point. Oh, only for a behind. So uh, first score for Daniel Hermans. I'll tell you what, a few up around the goal. Sort of was a goal. The car horn's going, but it isn't. 1-3-9, Winch. 2-2-4. <coughs> two, two, in disbelief. There he is, Knight. He kicked it in. He still, he still he, he reckons it was a goal. And he gets it back, Michael Knight, who kicked it into the uh, back pocket. He's standing at full back and got the, got the ball back, so he goes back, and then he goes to half back looking for Jones. Over the head, though, thumped away. Comes back towards the boundary line, and Bonner sees it over with Bridie as well. So it will be a boundary throw in. Winchell see still into attack, about 45 around from their goal. Higgins to do the ruck work against Lovell. And Higgins over the back. Lovell in front, gets it down. Clearing kick for the Centurions, but Mench just parks himself on centre wing, takes the mark, gives it away by hand to McKenzie, runs free, right foot kick, measures it to Hermans. Tornia front and centre was okay. Stephen, oh, he's too slow there. And Werribee, they be able to get to get free through Bray, who gets, uh, receives the handball and gets a kick to King. He's got five in front of season. He needs it. He goes towards half forward, does well. Montebruno in the pocket in. Matheson, oh, Montebruno was always going to mark it. Great kick over the back. Tyrone Montebruno took the mark and will shoot for goal from 30 out directly in front. He's a difference in the game so far, Grubby. Oh, well, he is, yeah, although I must admit he's had two kicks that no one could stop. He's had two kicks from upfield that were great, great kicks. So, Montebruno, good size run-up. <laughs> he's only back in the car park on St Albans Road. They all seem to do that oh, these days. What's going on? I only need four steps and a kick. He kicks it from 35, and he kicks the goal. He's so kicked he's kicked three out of three. I wouldn't be <laughs> questioning it. Grubby, uh, Winch... Really need to curb Werribee because that's where it's all starting from. And yeah. it's happened again. They get another clearance. Jones ran past the footy. Van der Kloos to read it well. 
Gets a handball to uh, advantage as they try to uh, get something going. Winchelsea goes towards centre wing. S Stephen eased out of that far too easily, I would have thought, as uh, Werribee Central's now. That's a terrible kick off the boot. Comes towards centre wing. Blusky, he can't pick the footy up. Season can't control. Fell in his arms. Now he gets a handball to Bonner. Back to Season. They're uh, now back to Van der Kloester and Winch are able to clear now as a kick to the middle. That's Davis on his own. Out wide, running was uh, torn out. Unfortunately, oh. uh, dropped the footy. and uh, Made two shocker mistakes, torn out. Yes, he's... Uh, Didn't come, play last week, did come he? Into Johnny the Mitchell side. reckons he's their best player. <laughs> so uh, the turnover's gone to Werribee Central's. Now to long to centre-half forward, Monte Bruno. Well, tried to make out who he's being held. He uh, contests the issue at ground level. Dives on the footy. Season comes in over the top. Umpire is surrounding it. What's he going to do? Surely he's going to blow. Uh, first quarter, ball goes in the air. Neither Ruckman can get near it. Uh, Bonner runs onto the foot. Immediately tackled. Doesn't get rid of it. Umpire said had no prior opportunity. They're getting them right now. <laughs> so the ball now, Jones doing the ruck work against Mench. Season on the left foot. Not a good kick, but he will find. Boundary umpire puts it in the air. Mench in front, punch from behind, uh, punch from the side by Braden Montebruno. Gains about 20 metres, but... Uh, yeah, so he has to keep turning. Boundary throwing again. Lovell gets it to the front of the pack. Leak over the top of it. Pack develops. And a half minutes in the first term. Lovell with the uh, tap down. Fenables tried to get the ball away. Falls to the side of the pack. Braden Montebruno, left foot kick back towards his brother. Van der Kloester goes up. No mark taken. Ooh. Off hands or thrown out towards Jones. Van der Kloester, he gets away. Handballs it dangerously. Back towards uh, Van der Kloester and Matheson. Down is Montebruno too. Doesn't look uh, good there. And ball comes back. Ryan Cornish, great kick. Great vision to Cassidy. And he will shoot for goal from 40 out directly in front. And oh, no. you, Monte Bruno is not looking good. If you good. put the moz on him, Eric, I'm going to headbutt you. <laughs> Fair dinkum. No, no, it's not, not, not a hammy. It's not a hammy. Not a hammy. No. He might have got a knock on the knee in that contest, I think. So Michael Cassidy, who has gone back to the centre nearly to kick the goal. Now that is, that's the longest I've seen. <laughs> that's ridiculous. That is the original Merv Hughes run up from the <laughs> boundary fence at Churnside Park. <laughs> Come down the race. So... Cassidy comes in for Werribee's fourth of the quarter. He really didn't start running until 10 metres out anyway. He comes in, right foot kick, very close. You know Goal on Pires, happy, I think. He is. So he's still in there solo. But he's not minutes. going too far, though, Grubby, by the same token. <laughs> no, but it still takes its toll. So the ball from the middle. And off the back, McGuinness gives it to Cassidy. Back to McGuinness, running free. Goes with a right foot kick. Long to Montebruno. Matheson leads in the race for the ball. Does well. Needs to get rid of it now. Gives it back to Van der Klooster. The quarterback gets it out to McKenzie. Defensive 50. Goes towards centre wing. Mitch in front of Morgan. And the big fella falls over. And uh, drags it in. Handballs it back to Bonner. He gets around on the right foot on centre wing. Horrific kick off the boot. And the turnover might come. Morgan gets back there for Werribee. Looking for a handball. Just gives it to Cassidy as he runs past. He's on centre wing. Goes towards half forward. It's a good kick. Jones takes the mark overhead. In front of Tornia. Wheels around. Goes towards Bray at half forward. Against the uh, against season. The other 15. Takes the mark. Plays on quickly. Goes long. Towards centre half forward. Montebruno. Got a push. Umpire said play on. Now at the side of the pack, Holmes picks it up under pressure, gives it to a standing start, Dunkley gives it away to Leak. At half back to centre wing, they're away here if it sits. Hermans makes up some ground on centre wing, takes the mark. Oh, he's, he's got, hurt himself. Yep, he's done for. He's no good. So he's on centre wing. He tries to drill the ball to half forward, and he just turns the ball over. And he's, he's in a bad way. So the Centurion's back through the middle. Salmon over his head, though. Dunkley to come at it on set from the centre wing position. Venables handball to Tornia. Needs to run free. Goes with a right foot tumbling punt. Nobody to kick two. Coming out there to pace was Donald. Coming there, Davis. Handball. Gives it back to Dunkley. Off a standing start at centre half forward. Goes towards full forward at the back of the pack. No mark taken. Play on the call. Murphy's got five against him. He's going to do well to get out of there. He gets the kick away somehow. Phipps, I think, is happy to see it through, is he? No, he's still in play. The umpire said play on. They all stopped. They all stopped, and he didn't. He kept going, took a bounce. Goes with a right foot tumbling punt towards half forward. Uh, half back. Mark taken by McKenzie for Winchelsea. So he'll be able to drive it back in for the Blues. 1-3-9. They trail where it'll be 4-2-26 and 50. 
play. You can't afford to give... You've played so good of a quarter of a football and you let him get an easy goal like that. And this fellow likes kicking goals, Mackenzie. He does. He's a back man that <laughs> likes to come forward. And he'll be shooting from 10 metres out. He's going back to the 50 nearly. They've all got this syndrome. Balls the 50 back. for, yep. He comes in, he kicks the goal. So Mackenzie the 50 kicks for. his first. Sprinting forward on no. the lead. No. So in the middle... Morgan up and down before acceptances, but it comes to Cassidy for, for uh, Werribee. The ball comes out of the centre square. Bray and Susan. Susan recovers best. Handball quickly. Went for forward. Up high. Mark not taken. Uh, Davis has dropped a couple of those. Needs to, to take them at centre half forward. Diving on the football the was back. Bonner. Might have been fortunate. He, no, uh, it was he, put, he put himself in position. It was Handball there. came out quickly to Dunkley. He's in more trouble than enough. Handballs it back. Now Holmes goes forward for Winchelsea. Oh, not a good bounce for them. And Werribee Central's that time through Knight. Handball back to McGuinness. They're working the ball now to Monte Bruno. Braden has a bounce. Handball to uh, the running player. And that's good play as Cassidy threw the ball. Threw it. Umpire. Threw it. Not called. Salmon picks it up, goes towards full forward. Bad kick. And taking the mark there was Bayless for uh, Winchelsea. <laughs> well, it was a throw. No, no, it was you commentating. Bad, <laughs> bad kick. <laughs> so, uh, ball comes towards centre wing. Ball thrown out on another car. That's a couple of throws that have got away. Mench, a little bit of a uh, fend off there. Goes to Bonner. Bonner now towards half forward. Players are struggling with the wind, I think, as uh, Davis picks it up, drops it. Now, oh. he's, uh, well, the umpire said he didn't have the ball. I think he might have had it and got rid of it somehow. And, but he gets the free kick, Davis, a skimming pass, and that's a good lead, Venables. Will he play on quickly? 28 minutes gone the quarter. Might need to uh, move pretty quickly. Mark taken by Higgins. Is it half forward flank? He's inside forward 50. Yeah, he want to keep the goal too because he had Daniel Hermans by himself. About 25 metres out from goal. He could have given it to him. And uh, I think we noticed last week, not the most consistent kick for goal. However, here we That's are. a nice way of putting it. <laughs> <laughs> well, his first four shots were points, weren't they? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he was consistent. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's consistency at its best. So Higgins moves in. Left footer. He's on the right side of the ground for a left footer. It's high. It's wide. It's In fact, it's not going to make the distance. It's tapped through for a behind. Two goals for... 16 winch, 4 to 26 Werribee Central. Buckley's Entertainment Centre, first quarter scoreboard. Almost 29 minutes. Quick kick in by Knight, finds McGuinness in the back pocket for the Centrals. He's called to play on. Goes down the line towards centre wing. Now, oh, McKenzie oh, in the oh, back oh, of the mind. Oh, oh. Tezalenko, <laughs> you beauty. Make it a screamer. Goes towards centre half forward and turns oh, it over. That's, a, that's a shame, that is. <laughs> that's the way it happens. Oh, Blake no. Warrior takes the mark. For Werribee, so all the uh, good work undone. He goes laterally to Bridie, takes the market half back. But it'll be on the video, though. It will be. <laughs> uh, it's $500 for Fano. Now goes Bridie, goes towards the middle of the ground. For accuracy, Salmon runs away on the left. Open now, oh. open big time as oh. the sirens sound. Yeah, unbelievable. <laughs> 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 oh, no. from all around your lawn. Second term here, 4 2 playing 2 4. Mench gets it down. The first tap of the second term goes towards Murphy. Tornia runs onto it as well. It can't pick it up. Central's across half back. The umpire might have missed a high tackle there, I would have thought. Knight gets the clearing kick though towards centre wing. Foot race. Van der Kloos to Mench. Jones, they all get across there. Jones will get there first. Back end of centre wing. Under pressure. Turns it over to the man in question. Davis handballs it over the top to Van der Kloos. Had to sit and wait. Gets the kick. It gets the. Uh, Ball away towards Bonner. He goes towards half forward. Higgins can't take the mark. Leak handball towards Venables, the two number ones. He goes around Knight, tries to get the handball. Good tackle, Knight. He dropped it. The umpire said play on. Leak got it away again. Higgins kicks it. It was uh, smothered. Goes back towards uh, Walson. Can he pick it up for Werribee? He can't do so. Fighting pretty hard for it, Winch. I think they've got the rev from Menchi. He goes with the kick out, Werribee. And Winch have got the numbers. They go across the ground towards Murphy in front and centre. Can't take the mark. Cassidy gets across there as as well held on to played for the free yeah, kick that nicely was definitely one. and wins the Logie and he'll get the free <laughs> kick inside defensive 50. You are joking me, aren't you? What? <laughs> well, the ball was four meters away and he, he had him by the jumper. Absolute you dickhead. crap goes towards <laughs> Walson, takes the mark, goes towards don't don't start, Grubby. Oh, <laughs> don't that, was start. that was a blatant don't free start. kick. Don't start. 
That was a blatant And flicking. now where have you got it? Colliver's got it. Back end of centre wing. Chips the ball short to Walson. Takes the mark. And he will try and move it towards half forward. He just chips the ball. It's okay. And Blushkey takes the mark. They're moving it back in board. Cornish sits and waits. So just changing it up a little bit centrals. And Cornish, he just chips the ball to Morgan. So making Winch pick up the players across the centre of the ground. And the big fella's got it. Bonner wants to try and take Cornish as well. He's called to play on. He goes with the right foot kick towards centre half forward. Tim van der Klooster. He's got his name written on it. And we'll settle things down for the Blues. 4-2 playing 2-4. Two, two minutes played second term. They've played out wide. Winch will see it looking for Tor uh, Tornier. Yes, just traps it inside the bandit. A little chip forward looking for Davis. Can't take the mark. But Chop the arms. Get, get a free kick in the interim. Good call. As uh, goes back into the corridor. And uh, Mench has the footy. Allu I'm going to say elude Bray. He should have <laughs> down the ground. Another, another that wasn't a free kick either, Jace, was it? I uh, wasn't watching that, actually. So, so, so ball <laughs> back into the corridor. Now Winch, the long kick into full forward. All seems to be all uh, Werribee Central's back there. Hermans has got three to beat. Walson comes into support for uh, the Werribee side. Handball to McGuinness. McGuinness back into the middle of the ground. All Werribee there. Picked up. Cassidy accepts the handball and runs. Kicks long towards half forward. Backing back is McClure. Can't take the mark. Probably should have. In the contest there is King. Used his pace to advantage. Great kick towards full forward. As uh, Monte Bruno back on the ground. As uh, chips it towards full forward. Can't get the goal. The uh, ball uh, numbers there with Werribee Central. It's a terrific work there by Bragg. Used the body strongly. As the ball now comes towards half back flank for Winch. Oh, Walson does well. Fell into his arms. Draws a player. Handball was cut off there by uh, McKenzie for Winchelsea. Comes back. Oh, Cornish is out on his own. Chips it forward to the lead. Half forward Cassidy going back with the flight of the footy. Can't quite take the mark. Comes back at ground level. Does well. Ooh, I would have he thought threw, threw it. it away. He threw it. However, kick off the ground. Uh, leak for Winchelsea. Stacks on the mill. Now there's the a back. whistle. It's going to Winchelsea to Rathbone. And, Werribee. Uh, sorry, to Rathbone for Werribee Centrals. Sees the lead. Kicks it to the pocket. Monte Bruno, two to boot, does well to get his hands to the footy. Can't take them up. Matheson, back to McKenzie. Long kick, gee, long kick to nowhere in the middle of the ground. It's all Werribee Central. Morgan, handball to Walson. He's had a bit of the footy in this quarter. Gets it clear, but uh, it is Venables for the Winchelsea side. Kicks for and uh, for. Boundary throwing now. Morgan in front from behind. Higgins Jones is there as well on the side. Tried to get the handball free. Cornish. Held on to Leak, calling for the ball. And the umpire says play on. Bonner gets free. Gets the right foot tumbling punt towards 50. At the back there, though, is, uh, and running through in the end pretty easily, unfortunately, for Werribee Centrals was Phipps. Ooh. Goes towards Cassidy, who gets laid out by Mench. And, uh, and I, I can't see no. there was much wrong with that. He no, went got to go. He went at the footy. At He's got to go. If he doesn't go, he drags himself. as cutting Monte Bruno. So Cassidy's up now. So in the hands of the trainers, Bray. We'll but that was good from Phipps. I know, but you show, you, you're the coach. Show a bit. There wasn't much in it, oh, but you show it. Bray's turned it over because he's got tackled, and they're in trouble now. Venables, uh, Brooke Donald's put the tackle on as well. So Winch will see across half forward, keeping the pressure on. Bray wrapped up by Mench. Umpire will come in over the shoulder, he says. Ooh. Ducked himself down yeah. into that. <laughs> and Mench is not happy either. So Toby Bray will have a second go at it. Oh, he thought about the handball this time. He elects, though, just to hold the ball up. <clears throat> yeah. So he called to play on now. Oh, he kicks it into Donald who ran in. So muck, mucking it up a second time. And Mench goes towards Herman. So <laughs> Winchell C could get the result and goal. And Toby Bray not having a great time at across half back. And him and Donald are having a, a how you do at half forward as well. And Daniel Hermans will shoot for goal from 45 out slide angle. It's a different game, Tommy, to what we had at East Geelong that day. With standard, standard a bit higher. Uh, the Centurions that day were absolutely magnificent, <laughs> but it was a very depleted East Geelong side we saw that day. Exactly. Eric. Hermans comes in, right foot kick, missed it to the near side and threw for one behind. First final, you don't get second chances in elimination finals, Eric. No, dead right. It's uh, where are we? Through Knight. Bring the ball in. That's a good kick and... Uh, found quarry out, half back flank they just in dick grubby they're running and feeding they are today yeah Werribee and uh, really good looking football as bray almost takes a mark in the middle oh rathbone a uh, colliver sorry ran forward accepted the handball and that's a great pass to the leading 
forward there till he gets up. I can't quite Might be see. Taylor, I think. Did well, yeah. <clears throat> Tis spot on again as uh, led forward, and that was magnificent play right from half back. We opened it right up with a handball, Werribee, and uh, deserved to be having the shot for goal. He's certainly uh, playing a bit of football so far in the game. They need now also, uh, like Herman's just missed a moment ago, Werribee Central's through Taylor, need to kick this goal. Moves in, man in the mark, 35 from goal. Oh, I don't like the uh, drop. It's out to the right, and that's where the footy went. So he's missed to the right-hand side. 4-3-27. Had to come in for oh, him. It could, could have been what it was. <laughs> Bayless now from full-back. 4-3-27, Werribee. 2-5-17, Winchelsea. He kicks in long to the outer side. Looking for Van der Kloester, who stands there. Should have taken the mark. Didn't, but he's got some support. Stephen handballs at Mench. Standing start. Gives it backwards. Bonner handball. Back to Van der Kloester at half-back. Goes towards centre wing. McKenzie third up, no, in front, punched away, did well. Walson got a high tackle, umpire said play on, then he got a push in the back. <coughs> the, odds, the odds are he's going to get one of them. <laughs> <laughs> so he plays on, gets around Tawny up and goes with a short kick into the middle. It's okay, Salmon takes the mark. Right in the middle of St Albans Reserve. Kicking to the northern end, he's called to play on now. Goes to the half forward flank. Long lead by Montebruno. Takes the mark in front of Matheson. Wheels and goes. On the left, 50 out, 55 out goes. Third in line. Good punch away, Mench, was it? No, umpire said over the shoulder. Advantage paid. Taylor walks in, kicks the goal. So the play on there. And Shots for five goals. Back to the middle. Lovell rove through the middle by McFarlane. Can't pick it up, though. Needs to now. And wrapped up. Lovell gets back there to put the tackle on with Rathbone. The umpire will come Don't. in. Don't. <laughs> and ball. <laughs> so ball up. Four to the centre circle for Winch. Over the back of Mench's head. Davis is across there. Needs some support. Leaving the contest a bit early, Winch. They need to stay there and uh, get the ball first. Davis. Salmon in there. For Three. A... Yeah. So Bonner's got it. And will come down. Him and Cassidy just discussing with the umpire the 50. I think... Uh... Braden Montebruno needs to be a bit careful. He's just I don't know, but that's a good 50. The present moment, he's uh, <coughs> having a few altercations with a number of players. Well, that's the way he plays, though, Eric. As long as he stays within the rules and doesn't do anything stupid. Possibly the quick reply for Winch. Bonner comes in, steps, and kicks the goal. So, good stuff. Grubby, don't you? If it happened, happened to Winchelsea, you wouldn't have remembered. No, that's right. <laughs> there's a free kick in the middle at the ruck contest. But, well, there's Mata Bruno's going to get himself in the real strife here. No, well, we grabbed the ball and went to play on, so he tackled it. All right, the umpire didn't pay advantage. He didn't know that. Doesn't matter. The ball's from Van der Kloester. Goes towards McFarlane. Curlin comes out as well. Wrapped up by Bridie. Got the handball away to McFarlane. Kicks it around the corner towards the 10 metre square. Donald. Oh, behind. Stood Too there. Good. It's the only bloke who Too stood good. there and actually watched the ball. And we'll shoot for goal from 15 out directly in front. He's been handy up forward in the, in oh, the quarter good. a bit so far. Yeah, good player. And, uh, in fact, it's Higgins. It is Higgins. And he goes back. I, I don't know about this going back on the long run-up uh, oh. scenario <laughs> for the balance or something. But he's gone back to 40, 40 out, and he's kicking from 10 out. So he comes in. He kicked four behinds last week, we said. He Not hasn't, this time. He hasn't this time. He has put it through. Oh. Again. Ball comes in. This time, uh, Mench gets the tap away. Lovell thought he was in fringe. Goes to Venables. Venables, a kick to uh, Hermans. Can't take the mark at half forward. Follows up. Venables, kick off the ground in danger, oh, said the umpire. Oh, rubbish. <laughs> so, His hands were nowhere near it. <laughs> he sold it pretty well there, Bob. <laughs> oh, yeah, so Phipps with the free kick at centre half back for uh, Werribee Centrals. Decides to play on. Gets around Hermans a little bit too easily. Goes out wide. Opened the game up, uh, Werribee, as the uh, boundary umpire fell over trying to get out the way. As the ball taken very close to the boundary line. It's uh, Rathbone, he's gone closer again. And uh, good defensive work. The ball comes, we're still in play. As the ball skimmed back for uh, Winchelsea. Davis takes the mark. Oh, terrible handball. Player was running. And uh, Higgins, now long kick inside forward 50. Two to one for Werribee Central's Phipps at the back. And he comes through, he does, kicks to the boundary. Off will get him to full forward because you've just seen his ruck and drops away when he's got a change. So uh, from the boundary, throw in. Werribee, get the initiative. As the ball, uh, well, it's just a uh, tug of war between Hermans and 
<laughs> Smaller player there. Umpire said, I'll have it. Yeah, good decision by the Prey Mantis. <laughs> is Jones a better option <laughs> the on the bigger Mantis. ground in the ruck? For the he centrals? doesn't want to play there. He just reckons he's not a ruckman. He doesn't want to play there. Not Gee, the ruck. He's, he's either coach. Ball comes back towards centre half, uh, centre wing. And the numbers again with Winchell C. Van der Kloos to playing that loose role. Do, doing nicely. Goes towards full forward. No mark taken. And Werribee. Oh, good, oh, good tackle. tackle too from McFarlane. Put it on. Most of the day. It's not his go. So Lovell is and gets it down to Cassidy. Out the back, it's okay. And the Centurions go towards half back. But Tornier gets across there first. Can't take it with him, though. And then puts the tackle on. Walson wanted the safety of the boundary line. Didn't get it. Tornier kick around the corner. Inside 50, coming out Curlin. Back towards the boundary line. Walson's there as well. And they see it up. Lovell. And Curlin doing the ruck work for Winch. Lovell gets it down to the front of the pack. Rathbone, handball. Short to Walson Ooh. and through the middle, Curlin. King came in as well. The umpire, oh, I smell a punce. He look, look, he's, he's looking hard for it. The ball, though, comes out the back to King. Handballs it over the top to nobody in particular. Needs some support. Oh, that was a high Ooh, tackle. Yeah. And it's going to be a free kick coming back to... What the hell? <laughs> well, the kick was terrible. Came out to Stephen for Winch. He handballs it back 20 metres to McKenzie. He's at half forward. Goes back with the right foot kick inside towards Hermans. Over the head of him. Wilson comes through, wrapped up, not going anywhere. Pretty good tackle. And the umpire will come in and ball. Just had the ball, played it on their terms, basically, yeah. haven't they? Yeah, look, I used to do that, but I keep forgetting to put them in. <laughs> <laughs> the ball up outside the We've uh, done them the since goals 2010. No, no, I did them earlier this year, and at half time it was three inside 50s to one, but they scored eight goals each, so I couldn't work it out. <laughs> ball in beside the boundary post for uh, Winchell Seed, deep in their attacking area. Neither Ruckman get uh, any sort of an advantage. Ball. Uh, where are we working very hard to try to get it out? Picked up That's there by uh, Luke. Luke. It was out of the pack. He's had a pot shot. Middle. Mench and Lovell. Mench gets it down again, but Jones roves it the better. Doesn't take it with him. Tries to tap it on out towards King. And uh, he got it back from King to Jones. He handballed it back inboard to Lovell, who sets him up. He got the handball away to nobody in particular, but might be okay. Rathbone runs off half back, runs through the middle, gets half a shepherd from Blusky. Goes with the kick outboard. Was okay to looking for to uh, go to Taylor. He has to wheel around. He went left, went right. Nobody to go to. Handball over the top. Van der Klooster back there, giving the shepherd. Little kick over the top. Was okay to Venables. At back end, uh, back defensive 50 takes the mark. He chips the ball over the top. Is okay. And... Stephen takes the mark at half back for Winchell C. So just slowing the play down, wants to go down the line, goes towards half forward. At the back of the pack, um, in front was uh, Higgins. He couldn't take it. Wilson, front and centre was okay. Lovell gets across there at half back, though, for Centrals and takes the saving mark. Wants to switch the play laterally across half back's okay to Phipps, the coach. Takes the mark. Nobody stands the mark, so he can play on. Goes through the middle, uh, squeezes it. It's okay. And Walson takes the mark right in the middle of St Albans. Just holds the play up now. Goes to the outer side, half forward flank. Mench gets back there in front. The big fella takes the mark easily. Plays on quickly. Kicks it back to whence it came. It's a nothing kick really. Knight over the back. Davis though runs onto it. Gets away. Jones is there though. He's creeping up on him. He got the handball away. Knight gets back there in support. Phipps. They're against Tornier. Two on one. Inside defensive 50. The coach just wants the safety of the boundary line. And well, he doesn't, doesn't get, get it. it. Doesn't get it because Higgins keeps it in for Bonner. He gets across there though. Walson helping out. And he's... Morgan doing the ruck work. Again, up against Curlin. Ball comes clear. Nobody can really uh, get the ball out. Gee, uh, there's some desperation there from some of the winch players. They're throwing themselves in after the footy. Stacks on the mill. Come on, up pocket players around the footy. Curlin gets a tap forward for winch. You'll see running onto the football was uh, Stephen. Can't pick it up, however. Finally does. He's immediately tackled. Finally, it is uh, Morgan. Picks it up. Ball in one hand. A la... Uh, Car park job. Yes. <laughs> uh, kicks it back toward the corridor. Good positioning. If they can get a mark, they can't. Front and centre. That was terrific work there Farland. by McFarlane. Oh. And uh, has oh. the goal. Fantastic. Prince Mench and Morgan back in the ruck. Morgan gets it down nicely. Davis robes, though. Tried to get to Leak. Coming off the wing was... Uh, that was... Uh, what's his name again? Novinick. No Novinick. And he gets it back to Rathbone <laughs> at half back. He goes back to the middle. Mench that's pushed a free off the kick footy. To it is. And yeah, he, that's a free kick. Oh, we're the did. only blokes who've got no well, have, have got what, an he, idea around here. He's interfered a, with He him. was. In, 
you can't do that. Oh, and Candy from the old man, if you don't mind. Menchi goes with a right foot kick inside 50. Venables one out, can't take the mark. In fact, it was Donald. Oh, they paid for the tried, tried to play for the mark there and didn't get it where he essentials. But they've got enough time to get through Jones at half back. Goes back to the middle. It's a great kick for. Uh, for Vision, but uh, can they take it away? They can. Blushki handball into the middle's okay to Cassidy on the upright foot kick towards half forwards. A good kick to Taylor, punched away. King at the front. Taylor's second effort was pretty good. Outside 50 handball to the call of Bray. Didn't quite, didn't quite uh, reach him though. Getting across their season does well. Got a trip. Umpire said play on. Close to the boundary line. Stacks on the mill. The umpire the ball up 50 around from the Werribee goal. Mench takes down the ruck contest and gets the kick away. Towards a vacant centre wing. Getting across there. Higgins doesn't sit for him though. Morgan and Jones across there. Jones handballs it backwards. It's okay. And they go back towards Rathbone in the middle. Create a bit of space. Can go laterally across the ground if he wants. He comes this way towards centre wing. Walson Hermans goes up. Takes the mark easily. The big and the, t- the uh, short and the tall of it there. And Hermans takes the mark. He's got Tawny on his outside. He goes further afield to Stephen, who made up ground as well. Took the mark uncontested, 55 out. Tawny, a keep running, son. No, oh, he wants to stop, stop now. So he hasn't got much to kick to because Donald's got a couple. He's got three on him, actually. And so he's just going to boot it and kick it straight towards him. And I don't know why he'd do that because Jones was in front and got What's that for? tapped on the arm, he said. So mm. Jones will take it at the uh, back end of the square. 6 5 41. They lead where he'd be 5 3 33 25 minutes played. Chip pass comes to Phipps, still inside defensive 54. Where he be? Looking for players to lead towards him. Chips it just outside the 50. Morgan. Morgan went to a handball. Now he kicks the footy. Goes towards centre wing. Numbers back with Werribee there. Mark. Oh, fell into uh, the uh, fell into the arms. That was a mark. And then it was an accidental mark. Yes, absolutely. Standing just a contest, two bodies, and it fell into his arms. So Colliver now goes forward for Werribee. Numbers back there with the, the winch side. Big punch forward by Van der Klooster. McKenzie runs onto it. Handball to Leek, who's running through the middle. That's good play from Winch. Goes long to, to full forward. Numbers 2-1 to one with uh, Werribee Central. Phipps takes the chest mark. Plays on quickly. Pretty Goes good out to wide. He's done well back there. I don't know that he's got an opponent, though, Grubby. He's running, running around on his own. And that's good play as he comes in. Board. Salmon takes the mark. He plays on quickly. Now Werribee trying to get a bit of uh, something going, but it's oh. Oh, fallen down in the middle. But the mark was uh, dropped there by Davis. Comes back onto the footy. Van der Klooster comes in to help him. Handball from Van der Klooster. Too quick for McClure. Now the ball goes forward for Werribee Centrals. Full forward position. Oh, good great play. mark. Great mark. That was to, uh, by Matheson. Too good for Ramona Bruno. Over the top to Mench. Mench now. Handball to the running players. As uh, Hermans. He's been a very good oh, lead up, but you've got to take those it. marks. As uh, drops the mark and Phipps now. Oh. Good work, uh, Four will be sent. No, another mark dropped by uh, Higgins. Working very hard at half forward. Wentz trying to get the, the ball forward. Stacks on the mill. In Teenager f- playing GFL 1s. Ballerine with Torquay and playing the Premiership. His experience just coming to the fore at the moment. A ball from the ruck contest. Goes back to Stephen now. Close to the boundary line. And it's over. Right in front of our commentary position. Stephen the last to get up. He's not young either. He's nudging 36. <laughs> So boundary throw in. Morgan. Pretty young from where I sit. Considering the pack, Stevens there through the middle. Bar- Braden Montebruno breaks a couple of tackles. Kick straight into Hermans. Love it. They love it. <laughs> it doesn't matter where Braden Montebruno is, things will happen. He goes pretty hard at it, Morgan. You get it down to Braden Montebruno. Murphy's there as well through the middle. Leak got three against him. Gets the kick away though. 25 metres out from goal. Tapped on back towards McFarlane. Donald handball back to Davis. Puts him under pressure. Walson, he handballs it towards the uh, towards the central umpire. Getting back there, Salmon. Got Murphy against him. Braden Montebruno through the middle. Does well. Ducks away at 50. Goes with the right foot towards Van der Klooster. At the back, tapped away by McKenzie. Hermans does the roving front and center. Does well to Van der Klooster. Goes from half forward. Inside 50. Goes up towards Higgins. Off the back, McFarlane with the outside of the right boot again. But oh. getting back there. Oh. Well, <laughs> Blake Quarren kick. So Knight whistled to bring the ball back in for uh, Werribee. Mark taken on the uh, 50 metre defensive line. <coughs> so Werribee Central's Salmon take the ball further forward. They're taking their time running forward, Grubby. They're uh, starting to feel a pinch on the big ground, so, uh, some of these players. You're already. Ball back to the middle. Nearly a one hand to mark again. McKenzie can't bring it down. <laughs> Curlin gets a handball forward. Goes forward, Davis, kicks to full forward. Gee, they're getting numbers back there, Werribee. And uh, Winch 
I don't know whether they're playing too far up the ground, but they've got one out against two or three all the time as uh, Phipps clears the ball, comes out wide. Walson takes a mark in front of our commentary position. 29 minutes gone in the quarter along the line. Mark taken by Jones. Can't beat the tackle, however. Gets the uh, Rasbone run down. Well, that's holding the ball. Well, Did I'm he get a boot to yeah, it? Yeah, I think he did. Must have so been the, a lace. So on through centre wing. We've got a contest here with players trying to get the footy out. Umpires watching closely. Comes out finally to the benefit of Werribee Centrals. It was uh, Colliver. Oh, he's tackled. Oh, I smell a punch. Oh, he's, oh, he's gone, gone the, the other way. way. Oh, <laughs> no. It is unbelievable. <laughs> Uh, so uh, but the thing was, uh, that was a punsy in the back. <laughs> <laughs> so into Phipps in the middle of the ground. Phipps now the lead at half four. That's who, who the ball wasn't who the ball was meant for. But the handball comes to Cassidy. Flying shot from fifty. It's a long shot. It's, oh, uh, it's taken point. through. I think it's a point already. As the siren sounds, they're going to yes, they pay the behind. So at half time. Werribee Central's 5 4 34 trial, which you'll see 6 6. I'm here to tell you how football is strong. Yeah.